Does money buy you happiness? To answer this question, I'm taking my five-year-old daughter Mila to live through the most expensive houses, hotels, cars, and so much more with the help of some of our best friends. But also, we're taking her to the cheapest. And by the end of the day, we'll see what a child picks. And now we'll start with the most expensive food on Earth. I decided to bring a professional chef to cook Mila a gourmet meal. And I will be cooking her a $1 meal, and I promise you, she will like it better. <laughs> Mila, Mila, do you think money buys your happiness? Mm. Hello, Hello, sir. And this is a gourmet chef. Spent some time at Cordon Bleu School of Culinary Arts, so, you know. Okay, so you both have 20 minutes to cook the best breakfast and the clock starts now. I already know what I got going on. We're prepared. Where are the eggs? Where do eggs go? Fridge? Oh, we don't have, we don't have eggs. <laughs> he has the eggs. You have to be prepared and actually bring your own. Do you need one? Do you need one? Do you need one? Just one. Don't be mean to my daddy like that. Can okay. you tell me kind of what your thought process is? So basically what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put together some gourmet waffles here. Dennis, can you tell us what you have going on? Yeah, I'm doing this egg. I've never seen anyone cook an egg on a freaking sandwich presser. Yo, give me! What are you doing? Wait. I've never seen someone did that before. And as time flew by, the gourmet chef used actual gold. You ever eaten gold before, Mila? And on top of that, he uses $500 caviar. This is going to be so delicious. Yeah, it is. Wow, Anna. Now that we have a $1 and a $600 meal, Mila has to try them and select a winner. We have a very, very fancy and very expensive uh, meal for you here. Some sturgeon all the way from Siberia. It's actually caviar. Okay, I'm gonna show you mine, okay? You have here my eggs with a smiley face. Yeah, I'm gonna try it. I hope it tastes good. Same, so do I. Mimi, do you like it? I'm gonna try his now. So remember, she's just a child. She's so innocent. She doesn't know what's expensive, what's cheap. It's only gonna go down to the taste and experience. So Mila, which one tastes better? This one. <laughs> <laughs> You get a point, congratulations. But little did Dennis know, things are gonna get more and more expensive. Okay, so now it's time for round two, but first we have to put blindfolds on Mila. You can't see anything, okay? Are you ready? Where are you? Oh, and for transportation, we got two cars. This is a $300,000 McLaren that goes 250 miles per hour with very profound interior. And this is an average car that costs $35 to rent. Open your eyes. Do you see these? We will drive in one of these cars next location. So for Mila to make an informed decision, she has to experience both cars from the inside. Wow. So which car do you want to choose? This or this? This one. This one. This one matches my map. I should have got her a purple mask. No. This is the right car for us. Okay, so now the score is 1-1. One, one. And Mimi, we're going to be heading somewhere you're really going to like. Yeah, let's go. So round three is going to be accessories. And we have three choices for Mila to make. Okay, Mimi, I have two necklaces here and you can only pick one. So I'm going to show you the first one, okay? Are you ready? One, two, three. Wow! This is a $50,000 diamond necklace. Whoa. Look at it, look at it. Come, it's come beautiful, on. right? I'm gonna catch it. I'm gonna put it on me. Yeah, wait, but before you decide, I'm gonna show you the other necklace. Are you ready? Three, two, two one. one. Wow! Daddy? Guess what? Daddy made this for you, and it costs $1. Mila, look, it says Mila. Is that my name? Yes. yes. It has your name. It has a heart. Can I put it on there? Okay, but you have to pick. You have to pick only one. This diamond necklace or this Mila necklace that costs one dollar. <laughs> yes! Oh, he literally lost oh a $50,000 diamond necklace. And before the biggest event of the day, Mila had to pick between a $1,000 sweater and a $19 sweater. Which one do you want? The this Mickey one? Mouse one or this one? This one. 
Oh. So now it's 2-2. Two, two. We're tied. We're tied. And for the third and last item, we will be breaking these two pinatas. But Mila could only keep what's inside one of them. One, two, three! Oh! oh. oh. Okay, Mila, I'm gonna hit the second pinata. Are you ready? One, two, two. Get me, Mama. I know you're happy right now, but we can only choose either the candy or the money. Which one do you choose? The candy. Yeah! I told you, she doesn't care. You literally, oh, you can it. buy candy with money and more than this. Now that we've had a $600 breakfast, rented a $300,000 car, and got a $50,000 diamond necklace, we arrived to our next destination for Mila to experience a hundred thousand dollars a day hotel. Wait, wait, wait! We're giving away a lot of cool stuff. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel and comment done, and we will send you the gift wherever you are around the world. Oh my! This hotel was ten thousand square feet. It had some crazy features. Dude, there's also a movie theater. Oh, my. look at this! And some things it had were not so common. <gasps> Oh, Mila, it has a sauna. Imagine playing hide and seek in this house. But don't let me get started on the backyard. Do you see how far does it go down? Whoa. Dude, Dude the backyard goes all the way down there. Down. <laughs> like, oh. my we were there. There's like 20 levels to this house. <laughs> What's the... Oh, is that tree house? Are you kidding me, Dad? <laughs> Look at this. Oh, my. Oh, I feel like I'm on the set of like Disney or something. But Mila didn't know what was waiting for her. And as it was time to head to the $1 hotel, we faced a problem. Hey, Dad, my trampoline! We have to go to the other place now to show you. Wait, Dad, we didn't play in the trampoline. No, but we have to go now. Mila! <laughs> baby, we have to go. Wait! She doesn't want to leave. Wow. We have to go, baby. It's okay. Oh, no. Baby, we have to go. I want to see this house. I want to stay here. Okay, baby, I promise you it's going to be a good place, okay? Can you me? I have an idea. Do you want McDonald's? Yeah. McDonald's? Yeah. How did that change that wow. fast? Mila, McDonald's is like $1. Yep, that's the point. I'll get you McDonald's. And in no time, we arrive to our final stop of the day. Mila, I'm going to show you now the $1 house. And this is the one dollar hotel. What is this? Oh McDonald's. Oh McDonald's. And here, Ennis did something very sneaky. He brought Mila's favorite toys from home to sway her decision. This is your teddy bear from home. Now yeah, watch this. Okay, let's eat. Whoa! You like it? Yay! I think we should all do camping. What do you think? Mommy's gonna lose the challenge. Okay, I'm just gonna go back to the other house with the big trampoline. Don't make me not like this house. Don't do the challenge. And now it's time to answer the big question. Mila, question. What? Mimi, did you like this house more or the other house with the trampoline? But since Mila enjoyed the camping vibe more, we decided to compare $10 camping with a $10,000 glamping experience. And hopefully Mila will change her mind. Before going to the campsite, my husband wanted to showcase his camping supplies. You love it! Look at my bag. It has everything we will ever need. Mila will enjoy camping. My dad taught me everything I need to know about this whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be praying for you in my glam side of the tent. And in no time, we headed to our camping site. <gasps> is that it? Oh, oh my, look, Mila. Is that it? Oh, Mimi, this is my. it. Oh my God, Mimi, do you see wow. this? Dude, this is so... So, Mila, I promise you mine is better than mommy's. Where's your tent, actually? What? Did you even build it? <laughs> Honey, I'm gonna build it now, don't worry. Mila, guess what? My tent mm. is already built. And that's my point, you removed the challenge out of no, camping. No, because we're gonna Camping is stuff. supposed to be fun. And this is my glamping site. Let me give you guys a tour. Oh my oh God, my come God. on. <gasps> oh, are you ready for this? Oh 
my goodness. <gasps> this is insane. <gasps> No, Mimi, you can sleep with me in the no. other room. My tent is much more fun. We literally have everything we need here. There's a bed, there's a couch, there's a fan. And there's also this thing over here. There's also plant. There's also this one. And the best part isn't even this. Wait till it gets dark because there's built-in light. And I had much more to come, so my husband had to get going. All right, where are you going to build your miserable tent? Here we go. Here's my fish. Here's my tent. I got it. Don't worry. I don't need help. Daddy is very strong. Don't lose the manual. Otherwise, you got nothing. Hey, hey, I know how to do it. This is good, Mimi? Yeah. You think this is a good spot? Yeah. Can I go back and play Jingle with Mom? No, Mimi. We're going to have to build a tent together, right? Now we fit. And my husband had to step things up before Mila has to make a decision at the end of the day. So we're gonna put this together. We're gonna have so much fun. Yeah, mommy's way boring. Mommy's really boring. <laughs> <laughs> we need to get everything done before it's sunset, okay? But my husband was quick to struggle with his campsite. Yeah, there's a menu here. No, that's not the menu. How do we do this? Yeah, it's hard to know what the boot is. I'm, this is boring. I'm going to my No, menu. Mila, no, no, no! Wow. I don't care about you guys. Mine is gonna be way better. What are you doing? It's okay, I'm good. I'm good. How are we gonna make it look like this? Oh. <gasps> Do you like it, Noah? I'm the best, right? Okay, I think I'm starting to get this. You see, we have something now. We have a skeleton. Here, look, we're almost done, Noah. Here, can you help me? The whole family's here now. Good job, Noah. Good job, Mila. Wow, I actually feel bad. You look like really miserable. Babe, I'm having so much fun. Camping isn't the challenge. Right, Mila? Yeah. Your tent literally fits one person. It, it actually won't even fit you. Wait until the end of the day and you'll see my point. Well, we did it. Yes, Mila, we're almost done. Here we go. Look. Oh my God, Mila, we did it. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Go, Noah. Go inside. But now the problem is the kids were starting to get hungry. Dad, I'm hungry. Can you give me food? Um, yeah, yeah, we're gonna cook soon. We just need to get fire first, right? We need to get the sticks. Okay, let's get the sticks. But my husband only had 45 minutes before the dark. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Look, Mimi, see at the end there? Yeah. That's where we need to go to get the sticks, okay? We're having a lot of fun, right, Mimi? I know, I'm getting so much tired. I wonder what mommy's doing right now. I don't think she's having a lot of fun. While they're struggling out there, I'm relaxing. Whoa! Oh, here, there's some sticks. Look, these are the sticks we want, okay? So we need to get a lot of those, look. Yeah, make sure it's not, it's not wet, okay, Mimi? It has to be dry. Yeah, this is good, good job. We need small ones, not big ones. You're right, how'd you know? Let me see. It's perfect. See, you remind me when me and daddy used to do it. My daddy. Your dad? Yeah. He, he used to show me how to pick sticks so fire comes out. Is this good or bad? This is way too big. We need a smaller one. Right, and it's wet. How do you know? You're so smart. Oh my god. Oh my god. But my husband was running out of daylight. Where's yours? Okay, get him, Noah. Right. Good job, Noah! Hey! I think we have enough. Noah, give me this. This is what I'm talking about. I'm having so much fun. Okay, let's go around quickly. Mila, we have to need light. Come on, come on, come on. We're losing the sun, baby. Are you ready to put the fire on? Yeah. Mommy, we have Where are you guys? We're having so much fun picking up all the steps. Are you going to make a fire with that? Yeah. Watch. Okay, while you do this, I'm gonna go and actually cook them a real meal. Honey, they're not gonna need your meal. I'm gonna go to my sophisticated tent. Once you're hungry, let me know I'm making steak. Look, Mimi, look, 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 look. Look, Mimi, it's getting closer. Come, come, close, come, close. Here, you come, look. Do you see it? And while my husband was wasting his energy, I can cook steaks on the grill. Dad, nothing's happening. No, look, it's almost, look. There's smoke, do you see smoke? Look, we could get this 
then we put them on top of each other. Are you ready? Okay. Oh. What happened to my tent? What are you got? You're still doing this? Noah, are you hungry? He's not hungry. He's not hungry. We're good. We're good. We have food. We have food, right, Mila? And my husband had to step his game up or he'd lose by the end of the day. Look, your tent isn't even ready. The fire's not ready. This is. I have always a backup. Look, Mimi. Look what. Yucky. What are you doing? Yucky. Look. It's good. Look, 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 look. It's sardines. You... That's what my Ennis. daddy. Ennis, Ennis, what are you talking about? Oh. Look. Look. Yeah. Look. Ennis. Oh, my. Look. She doesn't even eat that. Ew, I hate that on that. I only like eggs and pancakes. I got cupcakes and pancakes and waffles and croissant. And I made steak, your favorite. Yeah. Oh, honey, it's okay. I feel bad for you. But that's why I got extra steak, because I knew this would be a fail. I'm going to be just fine with this. Yeah, don't take Honey, my... stop. No. Run, run. Let's go. Noah, come here. Noah. Noah, please. Noah. But I... I had more tricks up my sleeve. And I really don't want to eat this. And as the sun was setting, things weren't looking too good for my husband. It's just a bad day. I broke my poo bucket. <laughs> and while my husband was struggling, I had some interesting plans. Okay, so now that it's getting dark, obviously, I have a plan, unlike my miserable husband over there using a flashlight. And I'm about to turn on the lights. Are you ready, Mila? Yeah. Ready, count down. One, One two, two, three, go! Oh my God. <gasps> Do you see this? Wow! <laughs> Do you see this? I'm yeah. so efficient. We're going to have a girls' party day. But we need the snacks! I got a bunch of snacks, and now the food's ready. Do you want to go eat? Yeah, let's go get it! Let's go! <laughs> Do you see this? Yes. Look, our food's already inside and ready, while Daddy's over there eating cold sardines out of a can. Yeah, that's so disgusting. I kind of feel bad for Daddy, mm -hmm. right? And my husband had to push his limits, or he would lose by the end of the night. Okay, are you going to go to Mommy now? Are, are you going to ditch me too? Yeah. Bye, Noah! You're making everyone ditch me. I literally invited you to eat. Come on. I don't want to come with you. Stop trying to prove a point. You know we're having more fun here. Honey, the night is young. We're going to have so much fun. And the kids are all going to love mine more than yours. But since my husband was stubborn, he had to put up with his own misery. How did my dad eat this? Yummy. Noah, do you like it? Yeah. Do you like it? Talking to my brother about something. Oh yeah, you guys are having a great time. But it's better than daddy's, right? I don't think he ate it. I'm gonna start if I don't eat this now. Hmm. It's not even that bad. Oh wow. It's not as good as their steak, but. Oh, where are you going, Noah? Oh, mommy. Daddy. You want to go to Daddy? Yeah. What about me, Mommy? Daddy. 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 Look at Daddy. Look at Daddy over there. He's so miserable. Oh. Daddy, you me, boy. Oh, he wants Daddy. I want to go to Daddy, too. What? You're going to leave me? Daddy. Noah, Noah, I have an idea. Let's go take food to Daddy. Daddy? Yeah. Come on, Noah, we're going to Daddy. Let's go to Daddy, Daddy. Aw, Daddy's lonely. Wow. Daddy, we miss you. Aw. Noah literally wouldn't eat dinner without you. He kept saying, What do you want? Baba. Come give me a hug. Oh, you can't eat dinner without Daddy. This whole thing is silly. Like, the whole point of this isn't even whose tent is better. Yours is better. Well, obviously mine's better, but <laughs> the point is, it's about family time. Baba. It's about us being all together. Hey, do you miss me, Noah? Baba. Oh, me? Baba. You do you miss, miss me, Mimi? Yeah. Okay, so are you guys going to sleep here? No. <laughs> okay, honey, that's enough drama. Come on, let's go. Get up. You're going to come with us. <gasps> Yay, Daddy's here. Honey, the only reason I'm here is because I didn't have my fire and everything outside was wet. What you were missing was us. Admit it. Okay, honey, now they make the decision. Mimi 
I'll ask you a question. Which was more fun, daddy's tent or mommy's tent? Yo, wait. Imagine though I had fire there and chocolate and s'mores. But he didn't. Uh, imagine I did. And although Mila didn't enjoy the cheap camping, my husband believed she can still have fun on a budget. Which is why for her birthday, he's gonna take her on a simple father-daughter day while I planned the most insane birthday party ever. And then we split off to our first locations. Okay, so now I'm at Target and to help find Mila's perfect gift, I got her best friend, Salish! I know Mila the best and we are definitely gonna win. And I'm gonna make sure that Mila likes my birthday party more than Ennis. Okay, so I'll come in, let's find oh, okay, the gift. Okay, let's go. Oh. Okay, wait, I think oh. I found the perfect gift. Where? A phone. I mean, it's like a bad time, she's getting pretty old. You know? A phone? She's only five. I don't know, but she could like text me. Uh, okay, I, I mean like, it. I just feel like a phone, like it's too much screen time and- So you're gonna be like a boring parent? I want something like educational oh, to get her mind going, like Roblox or what is I it called? I think her mind is going on a phone. Like this, look, Roblox, oh, no, Minecraft. No, 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 no. Yeah, no. all the kids no. like that. Yeah, all the kids are like 17. She's about to turn five. Come on, we can find oh, something else. Okay, but Salish, we have to be quick because I still have to set up the birthday party. I still have to get the cake. I still have to get everything okay, organized. Okay, don't think, okay? Oh, maybe like a bike? A bike? Ooh. I yeah, know. are you bike. sure she's Look, not they have too a young? frozen bike. She loves Elsa and Anna, and it has training wheels. I really think this is a good gift. Just don't you think it's kind of dangerous? No, like, she would impress all of her friends. Look, as training wheels, because I know you're like a little overprotective. Salish, she has been wanting a bike for so long. I just so is that a yes? Three, two. I'm gonna trust you, but yeah, here you go. I have to go to gymnastics and I'll meet you at the party in like a couple hours. Bye! Okay, now I gotta go bake the cake and then put the whole party. But I wonder how Ennis' budget experience is going. Hey Mimi, now we're at Disneyland! Yay! You know why we're here? Why? Who's your favorite princess? Elsa! So do you want to meet Elsa? <gasps> yeah! There's a big, big, big meet and greet that we're gonna go see today! Yeah. Today you're gonna have the bestest birthday ever. I'm gonna prove to you that this is gonna be way better than mommy's. Okay, Mimi, so the first step we gotta do is we have to go find Elsa. Oh my God, this is gonna be a long day. Elsa, where are you? Elsa, where are you? Elsa, where are you? Mimi, there's snow, maybe Elsa's there? No, it's a blue castle. So they told her that's where Elsa's living. Hey Mimi, maybe it's there. Oh, there's a white castle there. Oh, it's blue? It's bluish. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Do you think Elsa's there? I don't know. Is, Is she it? actually here? I think so. And while Ennis was looking for Elsa, I needed help baking Mila's cake. Okay guys, so I just arrived to Mila's favorite YouTuber house. Mila looks up to her so much. And it's Rebecca the Hello! I'm gonna show you, this is the cake we're gonna try to make. Oh my gosh, that looks delicious. It's a little, little complex. No, I mean, all you have to do is like throw on some candy and... Okay, make yeah, it. Yeah, I already baked the cake and now we have to stack it and decorate it. Okay, but I seriously only have an hour before I meet the party planner and I don't want Ennis to win. All right, here we okay. go. Okay, all so right, just so like... Well, what's this, white icing, okay. Maybe this is like what you stick it to, to stack it. Oh, is it sticky? It's like glue? Yeah. Spin it, girl, oh, spin it! Yeah. Maybe this like kind of right looks off. No, I think it's fine. Are you sure? You just have to add more frosting here and then it evens yeah. it out. I literally have less than an hour, so we gotta get going. Okay, well we still have more layers here. Here, stack. And this is the last layer. Uh, it looks like it's gonna fall. Uh-huh. Are it's you sure? Like, just stop, don't, maybe don't spin it as much. Wait, Rebecca, let's taste test it. What do you think? It's good. It's really good. It's good. It's a little hard. What's that temperature that it's supposed to be at usually? 350. Mm. For like 20 minutes though. How long did you put it in for? 
I didn't think anything could bake under 30. The vibe of Candyland is like a ton of colors. Oh yeah. Oh, that's good. This matches my outfit too. It really does. Wow. This cake. Candyland is, theme. It's kind of going good. Wait, but the photo has way more blue. I think we need more blue. Blue? Wow. Oh, look at that. Okay. Look at that. Okay, now it's actually looking a bit closer to the picture. Let's just add sprinkles and candy on all the stuff you... I got you. No! Let me get the um. Yeah, the the. How do you open this, Rebecca? I can't do it. It's okay. They don't mind the wrapper. It looks new, actually. Maybe we should add more candy with the wrappers on. Okay, come on. We gotta go a little quicker because I gotta meet with my party planner in literally ten minutes. Ah! No, 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 no. I'm just adding the cookies. If that Whoa! side is like empty. Oh my God, Mila's gonna love this. Ah! I was just spinning Wait. it. I knew I Maybe. should not have spinned it. It's okay. 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 It's okay. It's oh, okay. there. Yeah, yeah. That looks better. Oh, okay. It's good. It's yeah. good. Yeah. I think I'll just pick up a cake on my way there. That might be a good idea. I still love you. Tell Mila happy birthday. I'll send her a video. It's okay. It's the thought that counts. And as I was heading to the party location, Ennis and Mila were still looking for Elsa. Daddy, I don't think she's here. I just asked someone and it turns out Elsa's actually not here. Apparently we have to go all across to the other side. And after an entire hour of walking through Disneyland to find Elsa... Daddy, I think we're lost. No, baby, we'll find it. He decided to ask for the building Elsa's in. Okay, here we go. There's a map here. I think it's this building here. She's it so has new. a big... It has a big yellow pole. She said blue, so this might be the red one. I think this is it. Wait, let me take a picture so we have a map and look for it, okay? Here we go, okay. We're gonna find it, right, baby? Yeah, so we're going to the blue castle. So now we're at the final level, setting up for Mila's birthday party, and I have my event planner, Shumayla! She's from SoCal Event Planning, but I also got all of Mila's friends! Okay, girls, we have the balloon area, we have desserts, and we have the bounce house. So four of you over there, four of you over there, and four of you over there. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Get the balls, get the balls! Get the balls. Get the balls. Get the balls. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Yeah, 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 yeah. Time! I'm so ready! We need to make more progress, this is taking too long. Okay, let's go make balloons. Okay, go, go, go! Oh my god! We're good. Teamwork makes the dream work. Here we are! Wow. Mila is 100% gonna pick my birthday over Ennis. I think this is the building, babe. Are you sure, Dad? I don't know, that's what they're saying. I'm so tired. <laughs> I think this is it, Mimi, look. Yeah, this is where we are. I think this is it, here we go, let's see. Mimi, I just want you to know that I hope... <gasps> It says Anna and Elsa. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, we have to wait in the line. Oh God. Okay. Uh, this is a 45 minutes line. And after waiting for a long, long time, Ennis's plan was finally working. Man, she's been waiting all day for this. I can't wait to see her reaction. Hey. Oh my God, it's our turn. <laughs> What? Hello. My God. Oh my God. Look who's here. Who's this? Elsa. <laughs> Are you excited? Yeah. Hey, say hi, Elsa. Like a big warm hug. <laughs> She's been waiting for you all day. I'm so happy you're here. Oh my God. <laughs> she, she's. She's speechless. Mila, is it your birthday? Yeah. <gasps> Happy birthday. How old are you turning? Five. Five. High five for turning five. Thank you. Do you want to take a picture together, sweet snow angel? Yeah. Can you say freeze? Freeze. Oh my god, bye. Thank you. She's so excited. Did you like this? Yeah. Did you? Yeah. Isn't that the best birthday ever? Yeah. Yeah, say yeah! yeah. Say mommy, 
I think we're gonna win. But after a full hour of setting up with the help of Mila's friends, Finally, everything came together and I want to give you guys a rundown of everything. Oh, and we have five minutes before Ennis gets here, so we gotta be quick, so let's go. Okay, so this is Little Artist Party and they're doing cupcake decorations because cupcakes are Mila's favorite. And then after that, they're gonna be doing slime because of course we can't without slime. Okay, and then here we have the best pizza in LA. It's a wood fire oven, so the pizza fresh. And here we have Moonlight Mocktails. These are gonna be the kids' favorite drinks because they have all sorts of cool exotic drinks like cotton candy. Look at this. With the addition of a custom ball pit, a full-on bounce house, and a photo booth zone. I really hope Mila picks my party over Ennis's birthday party. But most importantly, I hope Mila has fun and enjoys the party with her friends. And they should be pulling in any second now. Everybody, let's get started. Come on. Yeah! Hey, Mila. What? Are you excited? <laughs> okay, you stop because you have to put your blindfold first. Okay. Okay, here we go. Uh, can you see now? I can't see anything. Are you sure? Yeah. But the party's right here. It's right there. Okay, I see him. He's pulling up. He's pulling up. <gasps> Are you ready, Mila? Yeah, I'm about to take off my seatbelt. I can hear my brother. I can hear Noah. I know. Baby. Can you promise you're not seeing anything? I can't see anything. I can't over here. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. Look at me, love. I can feel the grass. What can you hear? I can feel the grass and I can hear my brother. Are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> Honey, wow, I see you did a really good job. Yeah, honey, Disneyland got nothing on us. And before Mila makes a decision, she had to have some fun with her friends. Happy birthday, Mila! Happy birthday to you! Okay, Mimi, me and Mommy have one last question for you. Which birthday party was better, Daddy's or mine? Mommy! No! Wow! And it was finally time for a full family experience where we test the world's cheapest and the world's most expensive theme park experiences to get our final answer. And now we're starting with the $1 experience. Everything you see here is from our house. Mila, I'm not a machine. <laughs> I know Mila will love the $10,000 experience a lot more than this. You agree? I agree. So Sala's brother's here with us to live all the experiences. Let's go to number two! So now we're here at the $10 experience and we're about to go on the choo-choo train! Yeah. 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 For $10, <laughs> you can make kids that excited. That sounds so boring. <laughs> I know they are. Oh my god. Oh. 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 And the kids were having the time of their lives. Oh, he's so happy. <laughs> okay, so it's done now. You have fun. 
But little did Mila know things were gonna get crazy before she has to make a decision by the end of the day. Do you see how excited they were at $10? How excited do you think they're gonna be at $10,000? And then we headed to our third location, which is a little more expensive. So now we're here at the Santa Monica Pier, and we're about to go through the $100 experience. Where we're not allowed to go a penny over the budget. So the good thing about this place is there's no entrance fees. So we can go in for free. To go on the rides, we actually need tickets. We're gonna get them from We gotta here. be strategic. So with this 100 bucks, we gotta buy food, dessert, tickets. Mila, do you think you're gonna have a lot of fun here? I don't know. Hello. Hi. We have a hundred dollars, but yeah. we have to make it last for food, games, and toys. There's not enough. We need more. <laughs> it won't be enough. Beverly, I'm sorry. That's not. Oh, oh no! Look for the whole family. Absolutely not enough. But then we bought tickets to the cheapest ride, which was the Ferris wheel. We just wheel. spent forty-eight dollars. That's almost half of the hundred. <laughs> we spent half our money on a dumb Ferris wheel. <laughs> but before Mila experiences the Ferris wheel, the kids had other plans. I want an icy. <laughs> so then we spent a whopping nine dollars on the icy. But then I was tempted to get some ice cream. Can I get ice cream? If you get ice cream, we're not gonna have enough money to do anything else. But then I had to. I spent $18 on a single cup. And our money's gone. Yep. How much money do you have left? $24. So $24 for the whole experience left for us. <laughs> I got my $18 dipping dot. This is so stupid. By the way, food is the main part of an enjoyment anywhere you go. Okay, guys, can you tell us in the comments what's better for you guys? If you go to a theme park, would you rather be on rides or eat food? Rides. Please. Rides, right? You'd rather spend more money on food than rides? Yeah. I'm having fun watching other people have fun. That makes no sense. <gasps> okay, so we just got here. This is the Ferris wheel. I'm so excited to go on the Ferris wheel. I know, I'm excited too. Dude, it's so high because this is the $100 experience. We're standing in lines with the $1,000 experience and the $10,000 experience later. We're not going to have to stand in line. And after waiting for an entire 45 minutes... I'm actually scared. <laughs> we got closer and now she's getting scared. Yeah, look at it. Why do people do this? Has this ride ever had technical difficulties? <laughs> these are the doors. The door, these are the doors. Oh, they're that, locked, they're locked. Dude, I could slip right under. Where's the seatbelt? There's no seatbelt. Oh my god. <laughs> Stop. Just, we're going to tilt. You're too big. Go on that side. Dude, calm down. Dude, this is actually hard. Should I go on that side? We could have went on the little <laughs> ride. <laughs> Mila, are you having fun? Yeah, I'm taking pictures with Alex. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, look at the view. Wow. Oh. We're going up. <laughs> Why are you scared? Okay, this thing is moving. But there was a problem. No, are you having fun? Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> what do you say? Nothing scary for me. Mila, are you scared? No, I'm not even scared of roller coaster. Noah, don't be scared. It's okay, baby. It'll be okay. Aww. Okay, Noah, are you scared now? No. No. Are you doing a good job? Yeah, look at the mountain. Look at the view from here. Mila, I want you to remember this moment at the end of the day when you make the decision, okay? Okay. Okay. And since we couldn't afford going on more rides, we ended up spending the rest of the money on random games. There we go for the memory. Yay, Let's see. Okay, there we go, show me. Oh. oh. I'm still team $10,000. What are you? Yeah. $10,000 too. The $10,000 experience will include hotel rooms, restaurants. And then we arrive to our second most expensive experience. So we're here at Six Flags and we're ready for the $1,000 experience. Before we get on any rides, we just want to say how much we spent so far. Basically, the entrance was $836. That included the fast pass, though. Three fast passes. Three fast passes. This so is how much we have left, and we didn't even eat, buy any toys, merch. We didn't merch. even start the day, so it's going to be interesting. Woo! And as a responsible mom, of course we have to start with some coffee. They have Starbucks. Dude, Asana just found Starbucks here. I feel like the budget is about to go down by a lot no. just at Starbucks. Is it more expensive at Six Flags? Yeah, it's more expensive at theme parks in really? general. Yeah, coffee. Let's find out. <laughs> Hello. Uh,
Yeah, you want right. coffee? Want the same coffee. as mine? The uh, mocha frappuccino. Yeah, I'll take it. We'll get two of those. And after everybody got their drinks. How's all. it looking? That's all. How much? Uh, 38 48 is going to be How your much? $38.48. <laughs> Credit card. So up until now, we spent $8.35. How much did we just spend at Starbucks? $38.48. Plus $38.48. We have $127 left. And we we have, didn't eat yet. We didn't buy anything. I could only imagine how much food will cost if we just... <laughs> dude, coffee okay. costs $38. Noah didn't like the drink. We just lost $8. I didn't like it. You don't like it? I don't like it. Why? Let's try this. No. <laughs> it's candy, bro. And then it was time to go on some fun rides, but there was a problem. Okay, so we're trying to get Mila on this ride, trying to also get Noah. Do you want to go on this ride? No. Why? It's because fun. You don't want to go? No. Why? Because, uh, because I want to go back home. <laughs> I cry. You're going to cry? Yeah. Why are you going to cry? Because. But after seeing Mila get on some rides. Hi, <laughs> Noah decided to face his fear. You want to go with Mila on that ride? Yeah. Oh, you big boy, you're a man. You're a man. Right? Yeah. High five. So Noah's getting on the ride now, and we're getting scared. Mila's coming. Yay, yeah. yeah, Noah! This is his first like I've theme park ever experience. I think he's gonna cry. Do you think he's gonna I think, I think he's gonna, gonna, gonna cry. I think he's gonna cry. Oh my god, I told this him, I told the guy to stop the ride if he cries. <laughs> wow, no wow. Okay, so Alan's right beside him and he has his hands on his like, whoa! Hey Noah, say bye! Bye! bye. <laughs> he almost cried. He's like, I'm not sure, should I cry? Are you okay? Why were you crying? Because what? I can't. You're scared? Yeah. <laughs> you were so brave. High five. He's Good a big job. boy. You're a big boy. High five. But before heading to the VIP $10,000 experience, the kids met their favorite characters. And then we almost won the claw machine. Oh! <laughs> and after getting ripped off with three plates of chicken tenders for a hundred and fourteen dollars, I think one fourteen bucks just from these things. For chicken oh tenders. God. And then the guys decided to go on some really scary rides. Masala's so scared. She said she wasn't gonna come on. <laughs> to the most expensive theme park where Mila has to make a decision. And now it's time to show you what $10,000 gets you at Disneyland! Whoa! And then we got this one of one Mickey Mouse suite for $5,900 a night. I'm excited, Daddy! What's the spot is starting? What the oh, 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 oh. So I want to show you guys what $5,900 gets you here at this Mickey Mouse pet house. I'm going to do the tour. Okay, Mila's going to do the okay. tour. So Okay, wow. so this is the it's kitchen, gone. and this is a door. And this is the Mickey Mouse phone. Hello? 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 Where is it? You better answer for $5,900. That's what I'm saying. Plus a 400 square foot living room. Look at the Mickey Mouse logo up there. This is a huge suite. And it also comes with a fully decked out Mickey Mouse bedroom. Dude, look how nice this room is. And the craziest thing is the bathroom. Check this out. 
Oh wow! This whole room is Mickey Mouse inspired. Look at this. You even have the Mickey Mouse walls in the shower. <laughs> Daddy, look, there's a Mickey Mouse Yes, hold the towel. Dude, there's a Mickey Mouse this is, thing? This is crazy. In addition to the Mickey Mouse themed master bedroom, an access to a private pool. I don't know if this is worth a thousand dollars for one day. And if you guys are wondering if the Disneyland tickets come with this room, they actually don't, so you have to buy those separately. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. $5,900, that's almost six grand, and you don't get Disney tickets. And before showing you what a $10,000 VIP ticket gets you, we changed the kids into the $60 outfits. Oh, wow. Where's Spider Man? Right here. Right here. <laughs> Look oh, who became Elsa. Princess. So tonight you're going to decide? Yeah. Yeah. And this is what a VIP experience at Disneyland gets you. You can skip all the lines. Yeah, Are you excited? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> Why are you scared? I'm scared that I'm going to get wet. <laughs> you get access to exclusive gourmet restaurants, but you still have to pay for it. Mila, moment of truth. Tell me what you think of the food. Try it. Mm. Is it good? Yeah, you should try it. I'll try it. I thought like with $10,000, you get to drive in a golf cart with Mickey around Disneyland, but we're just eating regular pasta. <laughs> My plate is actually really good. I think it's good. Honey, how much do you think it's gonna cost? For all of us, yeah. I think it's gonna come up to like $300. $300? Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> moment of truth. Okay, One, how much? Two, three. How much? How much? $200. $198. Okay, listen, listen, listen. That's not bad. That's actually not bad. I thought bad. it was gonna be $300. Dude, in comparison to Six Flags, how much do we pay at Six Flags for just three? No, two chicken tenders and chili fries and a drink. How much do we pay there? 140 with the drinks. Yeah. And you just paid 198 for gourmet. Yeah, gourmet steak food. Steak too. Yeah. And finally, the real reason why people get VIP exclusive tickets to Disneyland is to get the best viewing spots for the fireworks. Dude, we're literally right in front of the castle. That's crazy. <laughs> Look where we are. <laughs> The castle is right here. We're gonna cry. <laughs> we're gonna uh, cry. We're so excited. Why are we, why are we gonna cry? Because Mila, it's so emotional. Yeah, these are like memories. We will never forget them. Kids don't cry from emotion things, and I don't. Because we're kids, and kids don't do that. <laughs> yeah. Oh. yeah. What, no? uh, I cry. <laughs> yeah. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> and before Mila has to make a decision on which experience was the best out of the five, we watched the most magical fireworks show ever. I could feel it in my bones. There was something going on that shut down. The laundry basket, we had the choo-choo train, we had the Ferris wheel, we had six flags, and we even had Disneyland. Okay, Mimi, which one do you like the most? Choo -choo -choo! Oh, he likes the choo-choo train. Choo -choo -choo -choo. <laughs> For ten bucks. Okay, Mila. Okay. Think about it. Think about it. Okay, seriously, think about it. Which one did you like the most? Uh huh. The Ferris wheel. Whoa! Wait, <laughs> wait. Why did you like the Ferris wheel more? Because we land on the beautiful skies and no one's so scared and I make him not scared. <laughs> so the conclusion of the past three days. And don't spend too much money on your kids because no matter where you put them, they're going to be happy. <laughs> That's the moral. Dad, money does not buy you happiness at theme parks. Can I get a refund for everything we did? Wait, I got you 